So it's my pleasure to introduce you to Dr. Wei Lu, uh, also from New Hope Fertility Center. Uh, and Dr. Lu has been associated in working with John Zhang for many years, as you've seen in some of the papers that were quoted. And he will talk about techniques in German of physical spindle and polynuclear transfers. Good morning. Thank you very much for attending this, uh, the conference. Oh. Dr. Zhang has to warm up about the nuclear transfer, about address the special on um, the geomenological transfer. So my title is also cover the title, but most address about uh, this technique uh, about the nuclear transfer is the first in, I think, about 17 years ago. Dr. Zhang have the first introduced this tech for the research about the, in the human art to to investigate about how about happen after transfer the GV into the human. It purpose I like previously had addressed about the, for the music era. So in the same year, we had tried a patient. The patient have to also get the get a two GV transfer go to go to donor, then the. the uh, Two GV transfer also were contracted and fertilized, and uh, and the mature, both of them mature, and developed to early stage were transferred. So that what transfer was not pregnancy. So, but okay. So in the following year. We are investigating what the reason cause was not, what the reason was the cause was uh, file implantation. So we, we address first uh, uh, use the mouse model to, uh, mouse model to, to evaluate the recontract outside, how what happened. In the following year, we know this procedure is, is can, can be work after recontraction for the GV transfer. And also in the following year, we found also another procedure is also can be work and the pronuclear transfer. Recently, we found this, this technique can also into, uh, have another application for the mitochondrial disease. So I pronounced the produce about uh, the libraries Many media was interested about this tag about three parents about the baby. So actually we most like this was called the nuclear, this procedure called the pronuclear transfer or spinal transfer or mitochondrial replacement. Actually mitochondrial, mitochondrial, mitochondrial disease can be used the tag to to prevent this to next generation because the mitochondria, the, the, the patient have the mitochondria, mitochondria disease was, is inherited, is maternally in this line, is not for the uh, paternally, so it was the reason I the cytoplasma mutation about the mitochondrial DNA. The red, we use the red as a mutation, a green as the wild type, it's a functional one. So one of the, of, for example, one of the mutation was the late syndrome at this point will cause the ATP dysfunctional, cannot produce enough the ATP to fill the cell. So that was a problem for, for the patient. This is the use. Actually, now have the procedure uh, uh, screening the, the load about at the, um, uh, at the blood system, screening the blood system for the mitochondrial mutation load. So some patients really have benefited for this tag, but some patient cannot produce the, the, 
Embryo with a very lot about embryo, but it's possible for the transfer. For that kind of patient, that one be, can be used for the pronucleal transfer. This, if not fertilized, if the most well, high level of the transfer during the blood state was still keep a high level. There is a strategy for the, how to use the uh, uh, structure can be transferred. There was the visible nuclear transfer at the, at the pronuclear stage. You can say also we can use the polarizer. We can also see the structure of spindle, make it the path for transfer spindle. We also, the GV stage, also another stage for transfer, also can be benefits about uh, for the patient of mitochondrial disease. If you use the, yeah, for this kind of patient, if you use the spindle transfer, you can see this is the patient, this is the donor. When you, this tag, there is uh, technically you can with the totally denuded about cyst plasma always has that amount small amount about cyst plasma included in the nuclear. So you cannot avoid some the patient mitochondria will move together when you recounter it. We are merging in the same contract outside. That will cause this tag, the problem is only can reduce, reduce the lot of the mutation about mitochondria, cannot eliminate. If you, uh, this is a red, red with the mutated. Green is uh, represent about the wild type. That, uh, you can see, you can see what's still, whatever about the spindle transfer, will have a still some minimal. The pronuclear transfer also have the same functional as the spinal transfer. Cannot avoid, it cannot avoid about the uh, still wing and after transfer, still have some the reduce the size, reduce a lot about the mitochondria. There are two, tech, two techniques can be used the memory fusion. We use the electrode pole to initiate the memory fusion after the transfer. So this is a parameter. The pronuclear have the pronuclear transfer memory fusion have the little bit wire the parameter you can see the spinal transfer have the in the middle. GV transfer is more narrow about the, what, the window to fill. So, electrofusion, fusion, there was a, uh, very effective. About the, most of the time, give the one pulse can use the can give them the, about the fuel. This another attack with. Uh, can induce the memory fusion was used in, in the study about the human spindle, human pronuclear transfer, use the central virus. This virus was inactive. Central virus used the protein. But this protein will be used, will integrate by the mechanism, will attack with the memory. This, this protein will be will be intact with the memory of the outside, will go later, go to, into the embryo. So the long-term factor, so, so far we don't know. This is the way you, uh, the fusion about the compare about the, uh, the electro fusion and uh, uh, with the center virus, you can see there is 
very similar about the both tech can effect effective to you induce the memory fusion, but there was uh, uh, there is we our study show a very similar about the uh, fertilization rate with uh, our control with the non recontrol oxide, and uh, from report about from the nature report. They have a normal fertilization is lower. It's only 33%. But the blood to rate both have a similar blood to uh, development in vitro. This is our procedure compared with the, uh, about the data about the, this is the fertilization control with the non spinal transfer this uh, donor oocyte. We use the oocyte, most of you use the donor oocyte with the uh, cryo, not the fresh. This is the blastocyst formation about very close, no difference between the in vitro development potential. This is also about the uploading rate, so it's very, it's very similar. So spinal transfer, so there will not increase they want to increase the risk about uh, uh, blastocyst euploidy. Then it's safe, and also safe for the uh, fertilization, uh, in vitro uh, development, and the euploidy rate. This is about the data about the, uh, our data about the polynuclear transfer. This looks uh, the. Like the plus ray, this is a U-poly ray. Yeah, this was reduced about uh, mm, look like the reduced the rate because we use from that report. Uh, it's because I think it was we used the frozen zygote. Dr. Zhang had previously had addressed about that. The uh, after the quiet and the, the saw. The pronuclear is, is very sensitive to the procedure. Some membrane will disappear. When you handle that, will be, will be, will be the no lost one uh, uh, embryo, uh, uh, pronuclear. That may be a cause of problem of the later uh, about uh, uh, in vitro, vitro uh, development. Uh, this is a show about the study about the humans use the both technique of the the data published uh, yeah recently. This is the pro nuclear initially by report. There is a very variable about the, this sample is uh, used the abnormal zygote study show a very variable about the blastocyte carry over of uh, the mitochondria. D uh, DNA. So we're variable from the zero to 39. So after this is similar group, after, after they report an uh, improved procedure, they found reduce. Reduce the, uh, the carryover over about the, uh, from the, to some is, yeah, come a different method, some is higher, yeah. So also show some the watchify about egg have the problem also cannot dramatically reduce the uh, the the, the carry over. Some was still the the lower some is the lower, but still is two percent about. This another study use the spindle transfer also yes. Was lower, it, but some it still can detect about the uh, carryover. This is used uh, another study. Used uh, this is this study is the normal fertilite and a test about the carryover of a blood system. This study is used uh, not fertilite. It's a artificial activate. This is used artificial passive node and uh, go to the blood to analyze the blood system. So, whatever about this, 
they can also have, as expected, is what has carried over about the, uh, from the, 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 the donor, nuclear donor set plasma was due, can be tested in the, in the blood system. So, so far is the proposed, uh, there was a question about what kind of, about, what kind of labor about the blood state can be used for human transfer. Actually, this is what depending on the humans about the, the, the patients suffer the disease, have a clinical medication depending on a lot about the, uh, the mutation. Some, have a medication most, for example, use the, this mutation point that will be above the 50% above, you can see the, uh, can see the clinical condition. If the lower than, than 20 is less possibility to get the uh, clinical condition. So there was a, Embryo screening for they found have a data have a screening if the embryo have a lower than 80 that give uh, then the 80 lower 80 lower is also show if the embryo have a 30 percent 30 percent you can qualify this is a threshold threshold criteria to for the transfer. Okay, so that will be so far. Uh, there is a question about uh, uh, we have the bottle system. They will do have the containing some the if you the patient will be expected will be have the mutate some even will lower will still have some the patient mutated the mitochondria. So there will be problem from, from the uh, genesis to the blastocyte. You can find there was a bottleneck, two bottlenecks. There were determining how about the variation because the, the segregation about the mitochondria is random. It's unpredictable. So that raises the very serious question about even you Transfer the female. This was the female baby was still will carry a similar about the mitochondrial disease. It maybe they were if they were also if the carrier they were transmitted to the next generation. If you use the male about the embryo, the the boy will not transfer the medical disease. So transfer, I use the current procedure, pronoc transfer and the spinal transfer. So it's more safe to transfer the male embryo. So transfer, uh, Whenever you transfer male and the female embryo, there were studies show most of the time uh, there will be safe. One study it show the analyze about the the stem uh, uh, personal genesis, the, the stem cell. They analyze about initially was very lower, some lower, and after after the, the 30 passage was still lower, but the report of very, one very specific, it will change. At this, you can say, even initially about this in a stem cell, first we can say, what kind of stem cell? This stem is not a photolite stem cell, it's from the, 
uh, uh, after transfer, uh, prone, uh, spinal transfer, and uh, artificial activate, then go to uh, a blastocyte. They isolate the inner cell mass and uh, make it uh, make a stem cell. Then pass it one. This is the one of the stem uh, cell. They usually test the test about the uh, the the carryover was lower, but after the twenty and the thirty. 39 to 40, they pick up, uh, the carryover, they were change, change go to the higher, even continue at the, at the 40 passage, they continue can only about that. They can very big uh, variation about from the draft. Some is very high up to 100%. Some is very lower to, you can only, only the mitochondria is from the cytoplasma. Some is from the nuclear. So that will be called the problem ratio, uh, the, 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 this tag. Whatever your procedure used, your, even very low level, it will, will cause the safety, uh, safety about the, the, this procedure. Because even it was tested with lower. But that was the in vitro study is uh, maybe a total different from the in vivo. This is a clinical observation about the study from the even used the early state, early state after birth. Some studies show they test the uh, mitochondrial, the, the mutation at, at the lower. At the lower, yeah. So study, this one show, this is a very, this lower level will not change with the age. When you increase the age, this will still keep lower. They have not found a, one case show will be changed as a, dramatically will change with the age of a, go to a teenager. They will have not found. So this also show only clinical, uh, clinic, uh, clinical medication uh, will only where high level will cause the uh, medical condition. Uh, there were some also concern about another question about uh, because the people, the cytoplasma, the, the, the polymorphism. Now, if you come from the different, different, if you come, the people have the, depending on the where they come from, they were, this map is, is the, is the, the 15,000 the year originally before the big uh, migration. You can see relatively uh, stable condition about uh, the haplo, haplo group about uh, uh, the, the, the human. The very different, you, you, the, the color had represent one about the haplo group. The color, you can show a different color, show the different, uh, different location have the very different about the uh, the people have different cytoplasma. This is evolution about hemochromatochondrial uh, DNA haplogroup. Yeah, we can see the the where the earlier. Yeah, we come from uh, oh the the tree is from the uh, from the L. Yeah, uh, from the so some is uh, from the of Africa or Caucasian. It the uh, of the H and the U. Why we use it? Because we we have the concern is how about we transfer transfer the uh, this study is a transfer different donor. Different donor have a different uh, ethical background. We 
we, we, we have used uh, different ethical brand, brand donor to, to invest the how about the fact in, uh, in fact the in virtual development. Actually, most of the time, is compatible. Yeah, you can see most data is from the, uh, this is a show the cytoplasma. This line shows the recontract, this is nuclear. This is a combination. This is a, each combination, yeah, this data is more Hispanic, ethnic will be support, have a more embryo development. Yeah, maybe the, yeah, some is a, whatever you see, the green line, so it's true, it's compatible. This we have not get a data about this. Uh, from this data, the green line is uh, compatible. What if, uh, whatever about you can support this, Africa set up from Caucasian nuclear. Uh, Africa set up from can support development about the Hispanic and also. <coughs> So here we can uh, get a conclusion about the cytoplasma. It can, can support, diff even have the ethnic background, it's different, can support the, the reconstructed, uh, reconstructed zygote go to the in vitro study, in vitro development. This study have the, the proposal about the, the future, how about the GV transfer for, for, for the, I, for the, I, the, or, with the, if the GV transfer will be maybe the final solution for the, to, Financial solution to maximally reduce the carryover. First, first, the, uh, why there will be after each about uh, nuclear transfer, there will be have uh, dilution about the the set of the mut uh, mutation set of uh, mutate about uh, from the patients. Mitochondrial DNA, they were reduced. After maturation, maybe you, uh, maybe you give a sequential transfer, this mutated will be go somewhere more or not more. You will, you will, can, this is peak, maybe there are more, they will pick, they will, maybe some, the, Chiroplast may not contain the mutated, mutated about the mitochondria. That create, fertilize this kind of recontract about the egg. This will be totally inimitable about the mitochondria, the, uh, the carryover of the mutant, mutant mitochondria did it. So, This is a GV transfer application. I think at that time it's uh, maximally to reduce the uh, the carryover of uh, personal genetic mutation. So use this tech, the GV transfer plus sequential uh, spindle transfer, uh, both male and female can be used for the transfer. So another application is about GV transfer it to restore the normal meiosis. The Dr. John had addressed the, the no problem for the GV transfer restore the structure, but so far we still have not evidence to 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 show that the meiosis will be corrected. So in the Future, near future, will be analyzed about the, how about meiosis to yeah to to examine how about the 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 uh, 
the segregation about the, the chromosome after the GV transfer. So use this slide, we can uh, summarize about the, uh, the tag, um, about the GV transfer, spindle transfer, peroneal transfer. So GV transfer is the potentially can be used yeah, in the maternal age related infertility. And uh, if you use the GV transfer, that will be maximally reduce the carry over about the mutant the mitochondrial uh, DNA. So potentially can be used for the female embryo from the, the patient created a female embryo can, can possibly for the transfer, not only limited to the male embryo. Spinal transfer and uh, pronuclear transfer, the application may be, may be benefit some patient, infertility patient, that patient have the embryo arrest at the cleavage stage. And uh, also can be benefit the patient about has suffered mitochondrial disease due to the, the mutant mitochondrial. Another may be application is the same sex female couples. They use it tag, the both can carry up. Both have a genetic related baby. Thank you.